Hi. Hi. You want to do the introduction? You can be quiet. Oh, you can talk if you want. Are you repelling? Yeah. All right. Hey, Dr. Todd Brennan here, Healthy Food Podiatry. So we have uh, some more toenails today, um, quite a bit of fungal toenails. Um, Non-diabetic, just tough time trimming them because of the thickness and how they look. So plan is to make them look like they're new again. Exactly, exactly. I don't want to scare everybody away. All right. So I agreed to do this for him, even though he's a Steelers fan. Forever. Forever. Even though Antonio Brown's gone. Yeah, I'm knocking on his head. <laughs> so he starts playing. Yeah. Well, he's going to play now. He's got fif 50 playing. million reasons to play. Right? With the Raiders. What about Le'Veon Bell? Where do you think he's going to go? Any idea? No, I don't know. No? What are you? the team's going to do, but it better do something about all, all of them. Yeah. Are you from Pittsburgh originally? Pittsburgh. What part? North Hills. North Hills. Are you from up there? Philadelphia. What is Pittsburgh? Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh. Oh. Pittsburgh and North Hills also. Have you been back visiting at all? Yeah, Ooh. for a long time. Yeah. I used to come back and forth. Did you? I haven't been for a long time. Been to that couple of places. Not that it's a big thing for me to do. Mm -hmm. Cold up there. <laughs> it's very cold. That's as bad as anything else. Did you go to school up there? Um, I went to college in Virginia, and then I did my med school in um, Ohio, which is in, we were about near Cleveland, so we were about two hours from Pittsburgh. So I got to deal with those lovely winters up there too, mm -hmm. which was not fun. That's why I'm down here. <laughs> about eight years. Looks pretty good from here. This one. That one. This one or this one. That one. This one. Yeah, once, that we, once we buff them out, they'll look a little bit prettier too. They won't be as jagged. This one actually had an indentation on the toe where the other nail was growing into it at one point. Doing okay? No pains? No pains. Okay. Did you say yet? Not yet. Okay, well, hopefully we keep, keep it that way. He doesn't trust I you. I trust you. <laughs> Now that I told yeah, you I'm from Philadelphia, you're like, uh, <laughs> I don't know if I should trust them. I used to go up to King of Prussia. Oh, yeah. I worked for Smith Klein. Oh, okay. Yeah, King of Prussia is, we used to go there to the mall all the time. The giant, yes, the big mall. The big mall. We used to stay at a hotel right near there. Did you? Where you always went after work. The place is a zoo. The King of Prussia Mall. Yep, it's about probably 20 minutes from my original hometown, from Horsham. I don't know if you oh, heard of that. That's where I work for Quest now because they bought Smith Klein. Okay. They're up in Horsham. Cool. Yeah, I think that I remember driving past their plant. They have a huge plant up there, if I remember correctly. Mm -hmm. They're big snappers. Mm -hmm. Are those like the ones you use on dogs' nails? <laughs> Maybe. No. <laughs> I used to have Dobermans and I had... I'm a vet, vet on the on the weekend. She got, yeah, the, really. she got rid of the dogs and got rid of me. Yeah, all right. She replaced you. The dogs with you. Huh? Two dogs. Two, two for dogs? One. Two for one. What kind of dogs? Dobermans. 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 They're nice they're dogs. big dogs. Yes. Big dogs. They're very majestic looking. And they're babies. They'll sit on your lap. Really? How much do they weigh? One of them was 90 pounds. The, only, the other one was only about 65 or 70. Only? That's pretty good. If you're going to have a dog, you might as well have a dog. This is true. A dog. Yeah, I have a big dog at home, too. He, he, says, <laughs> 12, he weighs 12 pounds. 12 pounds. <laughs> Vicious guard dog. He's a Pomeranian. Oh, but they make a lot of noise. Oh, they make a ton of noise. my wife's dog. 
Hang on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll play it while I stream it on Netflix or something for you. You doing okay? Yeah. You want me to save these clippings for you? If you put them underneath your pillow, you might get five bucks tonight. <laughs> I'll put my initial one. There you go. Thank you. I'll put them in a jar out in the hall. We got a we patient. Got a collection. Yeah, we got a collection of nails. There's some of this is skin. Some of it's part of the nail. It was, wasn't it? How's your hand, Casey? It's more of the back. The right? back? <laughs> you want to take a hiatus break? Switch sides? Mm -hmm. Here you are. Okay. I'm trying to go slow because if I go too fast, I get yelled at on, on YouTube that I cut nails too fast. Not the biggest one that I buy. What's that? Of course, that's like the that's like the climax, you know. We got to finish on the top. Good. Just a little pinch. Snail might actually fall off. It's pretty loose. Stayed long enough, it would fall off. They fall off? Do they grow back normal or just? Uh. Usually they would, but when they're like this, no. I mean, that whole nail just kind of came off. Oops. Yeah, once they're uh, fungal and thicker like this, they're going to come back the same way. Unfortunately, once they're this thick, nothing's really going to work on it from an antifungal standpoint. Clean up some of this junk here. Some some fungal thing I can put on my toes. Put on, like, on like this? No. On to soften it. To so soften the callus or the nails? Which just one are you talking? Just to soft, like just to moisturizer, you mean? Just to soft them down to where they're. Yeah, you like can. I put it on my shirt, shoes myself at home every night. You know, so. Yeah, you can use any type of over-the-counter moisturizer is sufficient so. just to put on the the feet. If you're talking about the actual skin. Then yeah, I can get you a prescription for some urea-based cream, and what that'll do is it'll help to try to soften the callus up a little bit, so it's not as rough and hard on you. Doing okay? Still awake? Still awake. <laughs> Yeah, that won't help the fungus. I mean, it might soften it up a little bit, but ultimately, it's still going to be there. The roughness of it, okay. as you would say. Sure. Yeah, I can give you something for the roughness of this guy. Let's see if we can get this. You want me to cut this or leave it? I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Tough. Making a mess. Mm, that was a tight one. Little neck. You haven't seen any blood yet. No, not yet. That's usually when I stop. That's a good time. <laughs> <laughs> and Susan will take her socks off. Mm -hmm. I nailed this one. 
I'll have a nicer boat. After this, your nails are going to look fantastic. Next six weeks, it'll be ready to just look like the same. Exactly. Still doing okay? Mm-hmm. Didn't feel a thing. Honestly. I didn't even pinch her or nothing. Good. Or snap her or stuff. I felt any kind of thing. Nothing happened. Take a break when I before I start grinding them down. Sure. Yeah, it says you should be looking for her back. Her no, that's what I'm trying to trying to help her out here. Let her get out of the room for a while. Yeah, take a breather. Let her go take some shots. You can go to Florida. Exactly. All right. Come to Florida first. Let me get my mask on here so we can buff these guys out. Start back over here. This might tickle. If it hurts, tell me, okay? The pickles. The pickles? Yeah, yeah. The bounces are a little bit. It doesn't hurt. Yeah. I do in the garage when I'm running on the video with the line and the bounce. So how do you feel that? Good. That's the goal. That's the goal. Pickle or hurt? Pickle. Pickle? All right. Mm -hmm. A vibration, huh? You didn't know I was going to torture you, did you? The tip just on the toe, and then it feels good. Just that tip, it feels good. It's just a little bit. 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 Good. There's other bleeding. That's more important. No bleeding. No bleeding. It's not good for business if you leave bleeding. The people watching at home, if they put 3D glasses on, it'll feel like the dust is coming towards them. Right?
Quanta? Oh, yeah? Yeah, now you're stuck with me. What's that? Same as nails. Oh yeah, absolutely. Next time you come in, bring make sure they're painted. Yeah, hey, whatever you do on the weekend, I don't judge you. <laughs> oh, no judgment. But... What's that? It's amazing what a little bit of nail polish can do, right? I'm playing in the snow. <laughs> Let me clean the toes off so we can get a final look here. This little one wow. right here. This look look back a, to normal, huh? Quite a difference. So you'll be good for 3,000 more miles now. What do you think? Better? Better. Oh Better than pre-nails? <laughs> All right. The before and after. Before and after, right? That'll be we'll a good definitely one. be back. <laughs> Thanks as always for watching. Uh, keep following us on YouTube. Like us at Healthy Feet Podiatry on Instagram, at Dr. Dr. Period, T-O-D-D, for, um, and hopefully you enjoyed it. Thank you, and we'll see you guys later. Bye. <laughs>